Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to do a little DIY for the front porch. Um, these are some of the supplies we're going to need. I'll show you that in a minute. But let's take a look at the porch. It's looking pretty bad. The only thing left for my fall decor is this mat. As you can see, it's kind of dirty and it's totally bare. So we're going to do a really fun project. Let's get started. Okay, for our DIY, we're going to need some cardboard, different sizes, scissors, of course, and some paint. I got these in some nice bright colors. These are just the sample ones, but I got the exterior. So they might hold up a little bit better on the porch, but we're gonna use just a classic alabaster as our white. We've got Kate's Ring, Autumn Blaze, Jeremy's Journey, and quite red. So this might give you a hint of what we're gonna be doing. Giving up and gone to sleep. Oh, I woke him up. Making progress. on painting the rest of the cardboard things and getting some lights out and just getting everything put together. Okay, here are all the light bulbs painted and the first ones I did are already dry. So what we're going to do now is we're going to mix this black with the dark green to get a really dark green to paint these bottom parts where the electrical stuff is and I wanted it to be a little bit darker than this screen. 
So I'm gonna mix that up and get those painted and everything's coming along really good so far. While all these are drying, I'm going to get in the shed and get some lights out, get some tubs out, and see what I want to use to go with these. Okay, I wanted to show you guys really quick before I clean this up. Um, I decided to outline all of them in black. I think it makes them pop a little bit more. What do you think? Some of you might like it better the way it was, but I like that little bit of pop. I could mess with this for hours, but I'm going to let it be. My husband's already unloading the totes. He can probably hear it out of the shed. So let me go get cleaned up, and we'll look through the totes. Okay, here are some of the totes. We've got some here, these, and then those. It looks like an insane amount, but we're not crazy. We uh, participate in a Christmas light display every single year. We do it for the Texas State Parks, and you just decorate your campsite up really nice, and it's to benefit the local food drives. So we've been doing that for, this is our ninth year. So anyway, we'll, we will be doing that, but I want to dig some lights out for the front porch. I'm looking for... Yeah, this will work. The warm white LEDs. I need some to go around each window. What is this? 26 feet. I need a third one. All right, here it is. That'll be perfect. And then I've got these specific ones I'm looking for. They're glass and they're round, multicolored. So I'm going to dig through these totes and I'll show them to you if I find them. Okay, we found the jackpot. These are the ones I want to use. They have similar colors to the vintage ones. They're pretty all in here. We use all of these when we decorate at the park. We're not going to go that crazy this year because we have a smaller site than usual. So we decided to ignore the messy stuff. My husband's working on the car back here. But we're going to use the big chunky ones. These icicles. I have an idea for these green ones. The white ones I showed you. And these here. And we also separated what we need to take to the park. Now that's going to be... Um, I won't post that here. If I can find an old video from our other channel, I'll link it at the end of this video showing the Christmas in the Park thing. It's really fun. But I'm going to get busy. There's a train coming, so it's going to get loud here in a second. Let's get to work. good but we still have our icicles axles toy and these big chunky ones and these green ones okay if I had realized that we had these giant bulbs I probably wouldn't have done the DIY but we've got them so we're gonna put them around the windows so you might be wondering why we used the green cords uh, we did that so our little DIY would look like it was kind of hanging from those cords and it would match Oh, and we added a sign to this old bicycle. It says Joy, and we also put the Christmas lights in our little lanterns. I have a little helper. He doesn't like this plastic. He keeps trying to bite it. Ain't that right, baby? Oh, I've got paint all over me. Gotta get back to painting, okay? Gotta get back to painting. Yes. Oh, so sleepy. I 
wanted to show you the little trees. I've got them ready. The backs are a little bit wet. Um, I didn't paint the back, but they were, I got a little paint on them from where I was painting. So they're drying, and they're going to go here on the wall. And then check these out. The gumdrop stacks. I think they're cute. Now those are the only pastel colors on the porch. I think that's okay, because that's what color gumdrops come in. So we're almost done, and it's getting a little bit dark, so I'll get to show you a nighttime view. Hey guys, here it is. It's pretty over the top, but I think it's kind of cute. 